morning, Tennessee High School. Today is Tuesday, October 20th. I'm Trey. And I'm Justin, and you're watching Viking News. Club photos and junior court photos will be taken on Thursday, October 22nd. Tennessee High tennis coach Reedy Tony has been selected as the TSSAA National Federation of High Schools 2015 of Tennessee Boys Tennis Coach of the Year. This is a tremendous honor for Coach Tony, who is also selected as the 2014 Tennis Coach of the Year. By receiving the award, Coach Tony has also been placed in the nomination for the Sectional Coach of the Year Award. If you are a club sponsor and purchased a yearbook page, please have your officers chosen by October 22nd. The 2016 Governor's Schools applications are now available and can be accessed online. The Tennessee Governor's Schools includes 12 summer programs for gifted and talented rising 11th and 12th grader students. Applications should be submitted by counselors on behalf of the students prior to the stated deadline. Please see Mrs. Skeens to submit your applications. Seniors who have applied for the Tennessee Promise may begin their community service on November 3rd. This is a change from the original January 1st date. Any 11th grade student who is interested in attending the Career Expo at Eastman Chemical on November 3rd may sign up in the counseling office. Space is limited to so sign up early. The practice SAT or the PSAT will be given on, at THS on Wednesday, October 28th. Any junior interested in taking this college entrance exam, please bring $15 into the counseling office as soon as possible. The PSAT is also a qualifying test that students must take to enter the National Merit Scholarship Corporation competition for college scholarships. Students qualify when they take the test their junior year, but sophomores are also encouraged to take the test for practice for next year. The exam will be given first and second period in the band room that day. If you need volunteer hours, the LEAP program operates in all five elementary schools advanced middle school from 3 to 5.30 p.m. Monday through Friday. If you're interested, call 534-6673. Here's your weather forecast and cafe watch. It is sunny with a high 69 and a low 40. Tomorrow it shall be partly cloudy with a high 72 and a low 45. Now back to the studio for your cafe watch. In sports news, the varsity girls soccer team will play South Doyle in the regional semifinals tonight at 6 p.m. in the castle. The THS cross country team will compete in the Big 7 conference tournament Thursday at 3.30 p.m. Friday, the varsity football team will play at Davy Crockett High School at 7.30. Come out and support our bikes. In local news, authorities try to plan and prepare to avoid active shooter incidents in schools. Now, Washington County, Virginia Sheriff Fred Newman has proposed an active shooter response system to increase safety in his county schools. In national news, websites hosting the sale of Star Wars The Force Awakens have recently closed their stores after over-eager over fans used the websites to pre-order tickets for the film. Most major theater websites crashed after a few days of heavy traffic. To combat this, the companies behind the websites have stated that the tickets will be available after the television debut of the trailer. That's all for Viking News. Have a terrific Tuesday.